Alright, allcanada.com. This is our So Bright Silver Dark. I like suggesting this to customers who want that darker tone, want the deepest tone you can get from our colors without changing the actual integrity of the color. This is our So Bright Silver Dark. A lot of our metallic settle to the bottom and stir it on up. You'll see it come to the top. And you can see that all that metallic plumping up at the bottom there. Get it back in the cup. Stir it up some more. This is in line of a charcoal, kind of like a charcoal gray is what this would be. Our Sobite Silver Medium would be more of a gunmetal gray. And of course you've seen enough of those so bright silvers, but see how dark it gets on the flop where it almost looks black on the flop. That's going to give you the darkest tone, and then when the light source hits it, it's going to brighten that color on up, but on the flop. See how dark it gets in the shadow, almost black. That's what we're going for. You want the darkest tone of that color. This is our so bright silver dark. We're gonna do a spray out of it. But uh, as I say, you can select down whichever bundle package you wanna go with if you'd like the color on an individual basis. This can be shot individually over any, you know, I always like saying two-part primer. I, I don't, I just don't like lack of primers or anything like that. So as long as you're using some type of 2K or soup, you know, any 2K primer or our super fill that we sell or sealer, two-part sealer with a hardener, you're good. But look at the extreme amount of metallics in there and look how it flops. When it flops, you how dark it gets, it gets close to black on that flop and that's what's going to bring out that real deep tone of our color or say of our candy color that's going to be sprayed over the top of this but this is so bright silver dark we do have one even darker than this we call it darker <laughs> but I don't have it available on the selections where you can select for it but if you want to go even darker than this almost like a black metallic base call us on up or uh, go with the so bright silver dark select it and then in, in, in the instructions the special instructions to me let me know that you want the so bright silver dark or you want almost like a black metallic state that in the instructions and we'll send you the darkest one we've got or call me on up so I already know what the deal is when you when you place your order so bright silver dark let's do a spray out Here's our So Bright Silver Dark. As I say, it's comparable to uh, smoke gray, but we've got extreme amount of metallic. You notice those white, see how white those spots are? Those are the reflection hot spots. We'll just call them hot spots. See how bright they are? The brighter white they are, the more reflectiveness this, this base has. And it's got extreme amount of reflectiveness. That's why it's so white, so bright. Those hot spots are hot because of the extreme amount of metallic we have in it. You can see all the white spots just as you're stirring. See how it gets bright when the, when the light hits that? This is so bright still with dark. This will, this will give you your darker tones on all the candies. If you want that deep, rich, dark tone of the candy, uh, I would suggest going with the So Bright Silver Dark and that'll bring out the richest part of it without changing the integrity of color. Sometimes like, just say for example, when you do red over gold, red over gold 
say red candy over gold base is going to kind of give you a reddish orange on the flop. You're going to see a color change a little bit. Not much, but it's there because red and gold actually make an orange. I don't like doing that, especially if it's going to change. If I want, to, if I want a red card, I want it to stay at red. I just want it richer or darker or deeper. So what I do then is I use the three different tones of the silvers. So I'll either use so bright silver to go with the brightest. If I want a rich tone, I'll go so bright silver medium just to give it a darker tone, but not too dark, but I don't want it too light either. Or, or I don't want the light version, so I want it right in between, but when the sun hits it, it pops like the bright version or like the so bright silver does because of the amount of silver. So it gets as bright as that, but when it's not in the sunlight, it looks a lot deeper and richer. Or if I want it at its darkest and richest point, then I'll use the so bright silver dark, which will give me that richer effect, or I should say that even darker tone. It gives me more of a shadows or, or, or like say more of that shadow to black tone of the color without changing the color. It just makes it darker without changing the actual integrity of the color. But this is our spray out. This is the spray out right here. As you can see the uh, so bright silver medium, how it reflects. And this is if you just wanted to spray the car by itself and you needed a kind of like a charcoal gray color there you go so bright silver dark all candy check out the bundle packages below